gone through the service we wait. I wouldn't feel comfortable putting my kids in the car with strangers. Nobody wants to be the guinea pig, right? Every driver for hop, skip, drive has to be fingerprinted, cleared by the FBI and the Department of Justice. Those drivers also have to have at least five years of child care experience. This morning, we do want you to weigh in. Would you be comfortable sending your child in an Uber or a Lyft or, or maybe just hop, skip, drive? Now, they say they put their drivers through a strenuous safety and security process before they ever get behind the wheel. We've got strong thoughts about this. Text them to us, 602-444-1212. Online, there's already a ton of reaction, including on our Facebook and Twitter pages. And so far, it appears to be a resounding no. Tom Martin on Facebook says, no freaking way, an abduction waiting to happen. A little tongue-in-cheek response here by Bill, as long as they carried a gun. Can't foresee any problems with that, Bill. Courtney Clark says, I wouldn't, but honestly, I don't think it's much different than when you leave your kids at daycare. Rachel, as a parent, I'm sure you've had to face this dilemma more than once where you're trusting the life of your precious children in the hands of someone who you're not entirely sure is capable. Yeah, definitely. And it gets easier as they get older, I feel like. When my 11-year-old, it definitely would be more tempting if he would have a phone in that instance. You could send him. He's trying to get to soccer practice along with the other kid on the other side of town. That's the hardest thing for parents when you're so stretched. A generation of people was taught never to get in a car with a stranger. <laughs> and yet our generation does so somewhat Every willingly. Day. Yeah. I think about it's, it. It's an yeah. interesting change in the way that we've thought about this over the years. And now I think kids, though, that's like the next frontier. I'm not sure if putting a kid in a car by himself or herself. We were talking about it with my son because we were saying one of these days he'll probably be getting in some.